Learn how to use ClassPoint's Word Cloud as a learning visualization tool right in PowerPoint for idea collection, brainstorming, warm-ups, and more. To use the Word Cloud activity in your presentation, first, add a question you want to ask to your slide. Then click the Word Cloud icon to add the activity to your slide. Customize your question in the side panel. By default, participants are able to submit multiple responses. For my question, I'm going to limit their responses to three, so I can see the most popular ways to improve health amongst my participants. During this question, I plan to be away from my computer, walking around the room, so I'll set the question to auto start and then close after one minute. Now the setup is complete and the question is ready. Once we get to the question slide in our presentation, the question will automatically open and participants can begin submitting words to your word cloud. On the presenter's device, the responses will appear, move, and transform in size as more words are submitted. Click on an unwanted response to remove it from your cloud. Once the timer is up, the question will automatically close. Highlight the top responses by clicking the toggle. Any responses can be clicked on to see who submitted it and award them stars. To single out any submissions for further discussions, use the search bar. Add the word cloud to your presentation by inserting it as a slide. If any additional notes need to be added, use the annotation tools on the toolbar. To review the word cloud after class, view the responses from the side panel. Fantastic! Time to go get your audience to create a dynamic word cloud together.